Pretty good. Now, I should mention, Vulcan has never done anything like this in the past. Now, I did send him, like, a pretty detailed message on everything he has to do. So, hopefully, this does go well. I'm honestly expecting this to go pretty damn good. Of course, something can always go bad. So, there we go. I told him to place his giant down on that side. So, so far, we're doing pretty well. So, um, I don't think he needed to put those skeletons down. But it's really not too big of a deal. I honestly think the giant alone is more than enough but oh well let's just see what happens also in the next battle i might just skip this part of the video because honestly the setup is never too fun i'm not gonna lie like setting up is always kind of boring so oh well okay so right now we're actually getting a lot of elixir and i think i'm gonna actually start the process now so i'm gonna give him the thumbs up or laugh and here actually comes the oh i screwed up my cycle already so here is the first giant and this is where everything should go Hopefully this does turn out well. Hopefully it's entertaining at least. So unfortunately his collectors are kind of overflowing. So that's kind of a bad thing. But oh well. So real quickly let's get our first giant down. Next let's mirror that giant. And right away this is looking pretty good. I'm not going to lie. So un actually no. Everything is looking really good. So let's get that down. Let's rage all that up. Let's get some more giants down. And I am kind of destroying some of his pumps right now. So that is kind of a problem. But again it's not too big of a deal because right now we just have so much crap up honestly this is gonna go really well i'm actually looking forward to this so we actually have a lot of troops incoming he does have a crap load of spear gobs so real quickly i'm gonna put another giant right there oh hurry up no it's lagging okay let's get one bowler down in the back one bowler let's get it look at the bowler go he's taking them all out it looks like the bowler did go down unfortunately and we are gonna be getting three crown but that right there looked pretty cool holy crap look at all those spawners he has too that right there is awesome we're gonna give this another go i just typed vulcan in the chat and he should accept this one any second so hopefully this battle goes a bit better he's asking if he should use the same deck so i'll just tell him that um oh is this him did he accept here we are let's get it i don't know what we did last time but that went really well so real quickly i'm just gonna get a giant down and some ice spirits and that should be good to take Take out that tower on its own next um uh, what do i want to do i think i i think i'm gonna pump up i think that is the right move to do so do i want to pump up actually real quickly let's get a cannon down i think a cannon is the right move now we can start pumping up Okay, we're gonna get another push going, but this time I'm feeling the giant and the rage spell. I think that right there should be a pretty good combo to take him out. So let's let that giant start pushing up. Um, let's just throw some skeletons down. And unfortunately, we are actually gonna cap our elixir. So hurry up, giants. Hurry up. You need to hurry. Okay, here we are. Let's rage that boy up. And now we can start pumping up. Now keep in mind, this dude still does have to destroy that tower over there. He is kind of taking a bit of time. Also, he placed the collector right on my giant. So unless he has a cannon, that collector is going to be... Oh, good call on him. But it does look like we will be taking that collector out, unfortunately. So I do apologize for that. But now, let's just start pumping up. He still has to take one of my towers out. But, oh, well, I guess he'll catch up eventually. I feel like he forgot he has to take out one of my towers. So I'm trying to think of what this guy's doing. But let's just hope he realizes he has to take out one of my towers or else this whole thing is going to be a fail he really i don't think he realizes he never destroyed my tower what is he doing guys this one is a fail already i'm gonna place an ice spirit over there and hopefully he realized he has to destroy my tower or else i'm gonna win there we go he said oops but i just froze his giant so luckily for him you know he realized his mistake right there because that could have been very bad like i would have just won right off the bat so he should get that tower down hopefully okay thankfully there's 12 seconds left and he should get that tower down i really yeah there we go so i think we're all set at this point so moving forward that was a pretty clutch play but let's keep placing stuff down and seeing where this goes unfortunately i did lose a collector due to that giant but you know it's really not that 
that big of a deal. Now, I am actually going to start placing giants right about now. So, from this point on, things should be a bit interesting. Hopefully, we don't fail too badly. And I do need to get that down desperately. So, Cannon, hurry up. Cannon, you just died on me. So, the Cannon did just die, which does suck. But, now from here, though, let's just keep on spamming giants. And let's hope everything does go well. Unfortunately, oh my god, his skeleton, get out of here. Oh, God, dude, I do not know what's going on. I feel like I'm kind of lagging a bit today. Okay, so, unfortunately, one of my giants did kind of get to... Oh, I bit my tongue. Holy sh**. As I was saying, unfortunately, my giant did kind of get distracted, but oh well, it's not really my fault. And my tongue hurts really bad. Holy crap. So from this point on, let's just get our bowlers all set up. Let's get one bowler right there. Next, we do need to kind of get the other one very quickly. Bowler, hurry up. Bowler, no, we're going to get three crowned. Hurry, dude. Bowlers, hurry. Bowlers taking it all out. Look at the bowlers go right now. This is how the bowlers are meant to be. Let's get another giant down over there. Now let's actually get a another bowler and holy crap this is actually looking pretty good so we have two bowlers right now let's get the third one down and just look at him clear this bridge out this is actually pretty damn epic so I'm gonna keep on pumping up and let's just see how many bowlers we can spawn against this right now though this is actually looking pretty damn cool I'm not even gonna lie like we have three bowlers just taking out a big horde of spawners I might rage them up in a second here so I think that'll be pretty cool as well so right now now I think we have five or four yeah we have five bowlers down so let's place the rage spell down right about now and this should be game over I think I am gonna throw a giant down for whatever and yeah this is actually looking pretty damn cool I'm not even gonna lie just look at all the bowlers his spawners are going down we're gonna throw another bowler down and yeah this battle right here was definitely a success I'm trying to think though what troop I should do in the next battle I do think barbarians would be interesting and I do think skeletons would be cool as well. Okay, we're gonna get the third battle going. I accidentally put Vol instead of Vulcan, but he should get the point across. Hopefully, he accepts this battle. Let's get it. So, oh my god, are you kidding? JJ the Beast, what are you doing? Guys, what is going on? First off, JJ accepts the wrong battle. Then we get the Wi-Fi bars. Oh, and he has a Sparky. Wi-Fi bars, wrong battle, and Sparky. This is not going good. This is the complete opposite of what I wanted. But thank you, JJ, for three crowning me and not wasting my time. I appreciate it. Oh, crap. Get the Ice Spirit down! I want to protect my collector. No, he smacked the collector right out of there. So I think, um, did I destroy all of his collectors? If so, I'm sorry, mate. Okay, now we can actually afford to start pumping up. So let's get things going. From here on out, everything should be smooth, or at least I hope so. So I'll be right back, though, once we do have everything all set up. Okay, we are beginning the giants. So there go the first two giants. Now, from this point on, I do just have to pump up and keep things going. So hopefully this one... Is oh, crap. He's running, actually, tombstones and goblin spawners. I did just want tombstones, but honestly, it's not a big deal since he's running both. That just means there will probably be more troops. So hopefully this one is actually better than I anticipated. So now I... Oh, my God, dude. He's melting my giants. So I'm actually going to place the bowler down a bit early on this one let's get another giant down and i do need to cycle through my cards kind of quickly because i do want to get another bowler already oh my god oh bowler go thumbnail let's get it oh crap i need to get the bowlers down bowler hurry bowler i need to get a cannon down um uh, what do I do, giant? What do I do? I need to get troops down quick. This bowler needs to stay alive. We just need the bowler already. Come on, bowler. Let's get another bowler down. Look at this. This is so insane. Holy crap. Look at the bowlers go. We got three bowlers down. Just taking all of the troops out. Holy crap. This is awesome. The bowlers are kind of dying a little bit quickly, but this is definitely awesome. Like, holy crap. This just looks super cool. So, I am going to play 
place a giant down to kind of distract because my troops are kind of disappearing rather quickly. So now let's get a rage spell just to tear things up. Now we got another bowler on the side. Let's put an ice spirit down. And guys, this is actually pretty damn amazing. This is a lot cooler than I expected. Okay, so let's get a giant down. Um, Let's get, yeah, I think this is going to be the end for this battle. So I'll probably just chill here and talk while the bowlers finish up this base. And I think I'll do one more battle. I'm not too sure what troop I'll use. Maybe the furnace. Has anyone ever used the furnace before? You know what? Let's give it a shot. What's the worst that can happen? Okay, we are on the final battle of this video. And right now we are using the furnace. So I will just cut when that actually happens. So I won't make you watch any of the setting up. But you'll see me in about one second. I'm back. But right now I'm lagging like crazy. Nothing's placing. And I keep getting Wi-Fi bars. Why? Why am I getting Wi-Fi bars? For real, though, it is the most annoying thing ever. I hate you. We are going to begin placing our troops down any second now. I'm just trying to cycle through my cards one last time. So here we are. Let's get things going. Here is the first giant. And here is the furnace. Let's see how many fire spirits we can get at once. Oh. Oh my god, I'm such a dumbass. Did I really think that was gonna work? Um, good game. But guys, this has been Eclipse. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like down below. And please comment what you want me to do next. I do really enjoy making these videos. They might take a long time to record, but I always like the way they do turn out in the end. So if you guys are new to my channel, please feel free to subscribe for more daily Clash Royale content. And if you thought this video was funny, entertaining, crap, I don't care. Please leave me some support down in the comment section below. But guys, this has been Eclipse and peace out.